We are now living in a science fictional world. John W. Campbell Jr. became editor of Astounding and readers began to discover Campbell-esque stories. This made a great difference. He was the best editor in this country in this century. Did I ever in my life read anything more avidly than Astounding? Much of what I am, I derive from what I read in his magazine. You've got to do lunch with John Campbell. This is where all the creation of his interplay, interface with the writers takes place at lunch. I have read more lousy science fiction than anybody else in history. The man was an out-and-out -out fascist. I mean, he was a straightforward, old-fashioned, American fascist, you know, pre-war fascist, as it were. The man was very shy beneath it all, this booming Lyndon Johnson figure. I didn't think he could go this far. He said, you know, the reason black people are rioting is because they're unhappy, because they would rather be slaves. And he believed that. Nonetheless, he edited me. He edited my mind. He's a damn good editor of my mind.